prospect theory is a psychological theory that explains how people make decisions when faced with uncertainty and risk. It suggests that people do not always act rationally and tend to evaluate potential gains and losses differently. Specifically, people feel the pain of losses more strongly than they feel the pleasure of gains, a concept known as loss aversion. For example, losing $100 feels more painful than the happiness of gaining $100. Additionally, people tend to overweight small probabilities, meaning they may perceive unlikely events as more likely than they actually are. This theory helps explain why people sometimes make choices that seem irrational based on traditional economic models. Prospect theory was developed in the late 20th century as an alternative to earlier economic theories that assumed people always make rational decisions. It was introduced through experiments that showed how individuals consistently make choices based on perceived gains and losses rather than absolute value. The theory built on the idea that people rely on mental shortcuts when evaluating risk, leading to systematic biases in decision making. By demonstrating that people are more sensitive to losses than to equivalent gains, prospect theory challenged traditional economic views and became influential in fields such as behavioural economics, psychology and finance. Now let's look at some examples. In investing, people may hold on to losing stocks for too long because they do not want to accept a loss, even if selling would be a better financial decision. In gambling, people may continue playing after losing money in hopes of recovering their losses, even though the odds remain against them. In marketing, companies frame discounts as avoiding a loss rather than as a gain such as saying don't miss out on 20% off, rather than save 20%. These examples show how prospect theory influences everyday financial decisions, shopping behaviours and risk-taking. Now let's look at some strengths of prospect theory. One strength is that it better reflects real-world decision-making compared to traditional economic models. Since people often act based on emotions and biases rather than logic, Prospect theory provides a more accurate explanation of behaviour under uncertainty. Another strength is that it helps predict patterns in consumer behaviour, such as why people are more likely to buy insurance to avoid losses rather than to seek financial gains. A third strength is that it has practical applications in fields like finance, marketing and public policy, where understanding how people perceive risk can lead to better strategies and decision-making tools. However, prospect theory is not without its weaknesses. One weakness is that it does not always predict individual behaviour accurately. While people generally fear losses more than they value gains, there are cases where this does not hold true, such as when individuals take big risks in hopes of a large reward. Another weakness is that it assumes people are always influenced by losses and gains in the same way. But in reality, different factors like personality, culture and experience can affect decision making. A third weakness is that it focuses mainly on financial or risk-based decisions and may not fully explain other types of choices such as moral or social decisions that involve complex reasoning. Now let's explore some alternatives. One alternative is expected utility theory which assumes that people make decisions by calculating the expected benefits of each option and choosing the one with the highest value. While this model assumes rational decision-making, it does not account for biases like loss aversion. Another alternative is regret theory, which suggests that people make decisions based on minimising future regret rather than maximising expected value. A third alternative is fast and frugal heuristics, which focus on the idea that people rely on simple mental shortcuts to make quick decisions rather than carefully analysing all options. While prospect theory provides valuable insights, these alternatives offer different perspectives on human decision-making. 